Hey guys, Coach Moore here. I'm going to demonstrate our sissy squat. So we've got for this, this is going to be an accessory exercise for us. What we've got is one of these rogue wedges. You could also do this with a 45 pound plate with a dumbbell underneath or some variation of just elevating your heels. So I'm going to come out of frame here a little bit just so you can uh, see the wedge. But ultimately, feet are going to be elevated on the wedge. Highly recommend you guys have something to stabilize yourselves with, especially when you're starting on this. We wanna make sure that we don't fucking bust our asses. We're just gonna come down. I like to start on this with my toes on the floor, so just my heels are elevated. And what we're thinking about doing is just keeping our torso stacked and shooting our knees nice and far forward as we lean back and you can feel your quads start to get hot. As soon as your heels start to come, get uh, light, then you're gonna come up. So we're driving our knees forward, not letting them angle in. We're pushing them out and then we're coming back up. And what you want to be mindful of when you're doing this is if you're getting way down here and your toes are coming up, we're kind of losing, or our heels are coming up, we're losing the effect. So we want to keep our heels rooted as good as we can. And then we're driving our knees forward. You're going to feel your quads engage. Now, you might feel tightness in your knees, but provided you don't have any sharp knee pain, this is a totally accessible lift. So that's our sissy squat.